Hey guys, it's Coach Mike. Today I want to share with you a valuable tip that's going to save you time, heartache, and money, okay? It deals with what to do with a coach's phone number. So the first question is, how do you get the coach's phone number? In an email from a college coach, you need to go down to the bottom and see if there is a phone number. Now, the phone number is a huge clue. Actually, the whole email from a coach is going to be a clue for you of whether or not they're interested. If you see an office number or a mobile phone number, that's a huge uh, clue that they are open to having you contact them. Think about it like this. If you are gonna hand out your phone number, only gonna give your number out to the people that you are okay uh, with and that you have no issue if they reach back out to you or, or text you or call you, right? Now, if you get the phone number from a coach, remember, use that number, don't abuse that number. So make sure that you take the time to uh, prepare ahead what you're gonna say when you reach out to the coach. Um, a phone call is a great way to get some information, uh, get a read, if you will, test the voice and interest and, and those kinds of clues uh, that'll help you determine if that coach is genuinely interested in you. So also, if you're gonna call a office number, be prepared to leave a voicemail. Now I'm gonna go over exactly what to do in a, in a voicemail in another video, but just know be prepared ahead of time. And lastly, when you're communicating with a coach, make sure that you keep it short and sweet and to the point. Typically a phone conversation between five and 15 minutes is gonna be appropriate. Good luck to you. If you have any questions, contact me below or uh, find me online at Coach Mike or at Michael Woosley. Good luck.